As everyone knows, hospitality is not just hotel management, but also includes tourism, business, and event management as well. And the profession that I would like to talk about today, and it's my goal, is the inference career. Have you ever watched Faro's channel? He is Thai travel influencer. His programs are about traveling to different places and learning different cultures. So I know the world by virtual traveling with him. After I followed him for a long time, I feel that I really want to do this career. I want to create content that makes viewers feel that they actually went on a trip with me. And I want to share interesting information to others, which uses both knowledge in tourism and event management combined together. So I thought that if I could learn more about this aspect, it will give me the ability to create my content and vlogs that are different from others in good quality. And I will do it by sincerity to create honest content that will impress the viewers. And that's why me, on City One Upala, choose to study in the field of tourism service innovation at the Sitani College. Thank you. Three, two, one. Bang, bang. Come on, Alice. I spent two and a half years to find my passion, which is hospitality. Back in 2019, I was already studying engineering, but I didn't enjoy it. I just studied it because of my parents. So I started to find other alternatives that I'm really passionate about, like doctors, lawyers, accountants, a lot of things. Then, in 2022, I was attending a relatives wedding in Myanmar. It was an outdoor wedding at the beach. And all of a sudden, it started to rain. It was in the middle of the ceremony, and everyone was running. So it was a total chaos. However, the banquet manager, she came running down, and with the management of that lady and the collaboration of the hotel staff, they managed to prepare a wedding which is more beautiful than before. And there, I saw a wonder. A wonder changing all kinds of difficult situations into a moment of joy. I can see their efforts and their proud smiles, and that's intrigued me. At that moment, I was inspired. At that moment, I cannot wait to dive into the field of hospitality do, to create do, happiness do, do, for people. Do, time is up. <laughs> I'm sorry. No worries. <laughs> Thank you so much, Alice. Very inspiring. I would love to hear more of your stories. If we want to talk about women empowerment in the hotel industry, I think Kusupati Sutampan, CEO of the Sikh International, would automatically pop up. She is the first Thai woman to have become an executive of IBM and CEO of Tycom. She is now pursuing her journey with a passion expensing Chinese to the world. That's why she then became the CEO of the Sikh International. However, her journey was soon filled with losses as COVID-19 hit the hospitality industry severely. But because of her experience and skin, she dropped the group out of the storm beautifully. Those are the reasons why she had inspired me to Peru's dream. My name is Prang, a soon-to-be hotelier. I had an opportunity to talk with her once, and it made me realize that gender limitations are not a barrier for women anymore. I will always hold that convenient to my heart. As she said, we shouldn't wait till we know 100%, but we should 100% with all we know. Thank you. When you explore your experience, when you experience, you grab an opportunity for yourself. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Me, myself, Richard Chabe. Today, I'm going to tell you a short story about myself. It started off when my parents sent me abroad to study. It, it was a very cultural country, but what changed me was food, and I was very much passionate, so I started generalizing in my diary. I found my passion, that's why I joined Dusitani College, to follow my success to become a professional chef. 
I want to tell you all, you don't have to get inspired by somebody else. You can be your own inspirations, lead to your dream because you will be passionate and resilient enough to overcome all the challenge in your life. Change your passion into career. Thank you. Bang, bang. I had a dream becoming a doctor since I was shy. Because I want to help other people and my family, so can they live longer with me? During high school, I tried my best to uh, enter medical science program. But when I was there, I wasn't mine in that way, so I didn't go further with it. But my passion to save people is still the same. Then I came to study at DTC and see what my passion. My passion is I like to cooking. And I found that my passion to save the people, I will continue to work happily and make people live happily. Thank you. I'm Thai, and I'm very proud to be Thai. As many would agree, I believe that Thai culture brings a lot to hospitality. Thai culture is an unspoken language which shows utmost respect to everyone. I'm Tanawat, a second year student at the Sitani College. And as with many others, my inspiration to hospitality arose from my own family and my love of food. I spent numerous years studying abroad, and what I wish I was able to do is to bring back all of the different cultures and experiences and share it with my friends and family back home. This is what actually pushed me to pursue a career in culinary arts. Food can communicate much without saying a single word. I, I was able to share my experience, share Thai culture and with my friends, and we were able to bring smiles to everyone's faces with just a presentation of the food. This is why I hope to one day be able to open my own restaurant and be able to share the joy and happiness through my own unique creations. Thank you. Inspiration sometimes come when we fall at the rock bottom. I had already graduated from bachelor degree, major in sport. However, after I graduated, I feel that sport is not enough for my career. Then I came across with a new area of development, hospitality, as I enjoy taking care of people and it is part of my family business. So I take this opportunity as a challenge to combine sport and hospitality together and bring them to the next level. By creating a resort that allows everyone to enjoy sport and exercises together with many activities provided for all ages. Hence, I decided to get back to study on my second bachelor degree, major in hospitality management at the Dusitani College with the desire to, make a, to create a new market segment for hospitality industry. Thank you. There are several people who inspire me, but I believe the largest inspiration is my family. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Holly. Goes back to when I was young. I am the youngest of two daughters in family. I started cooking with my mom who inspired me. My first menu was a spaghetti of tomato sauce. And my first person to test this was my dad. He responded to me, wow, so wonderful, he said to his five-year-old daughter. This started my passion, my dream, and my goal to become a good chef like my mom. Since then, I always try to be better, improve myself every day, challenging myself, collecting experiences, and just believe yourself like me believe in myself and just do it that's why i am the youngest person in the master chef thailand season five thank you so um great ambition is the passion of a great character a quote i've recently learned that stated by the great napoleon himself from this quote, I was able to understand the value of passion and ambition in an individual's character. Now, 
I want to date back and reminisce to my childhood memory. I was just a little boy when I attended this charity event with my grandma. And we were donating school supplies to little kids in need. There was this one moment when I handed out the school supplies to this little girl. Honestly, at first, I didn't expect much out of it until I saw the biggest smile grew on her face. I saw happiness lit up in her eyes, and her body was filled up with nothing but joy and excitement. That's when it hit me. From that moment, I made a discovery of what my passion is, which is simply the honest service I provide to people. And that made me become ambitious. I became persistent to provide any act of service to people. That's how I was led into pursuing this industry. As a result, so far, my passion is what drives me to greater ambition. Hence, five years from now, if you're seeking for an ambitious business partner, I'm Joey Meng. I aspire to become a breakthrough in the hospitality industry. Thank you.